Live stream fail. That's right. The place with some of the craziest things happening. Let me tell you today, we have some interesting things from NFTs to uh, ASMR streams to our very own VTubers making it on LSF. Just never know. So we're going to see the funny, the sad, the cringe. We're going to all experience it at once. And so let's get right into it. Hey, what's going on, everybody? I'm Derek Z, creator, founder, artist of Metadex. And uh, I just want to make a quick little video um, because... Uh, uh, we just got retweeted by the slime machine um, relating to the NFT trading card for Ludwig. I feel like like if you're literally just like like making art of someone and trying to sell it, uh, technically there are laws around like likeness and utilizing that likeness to a degree. And so, I don't know. I really don't like NFTs in this. And it's really weird to me. And it feels really, uh, I don't know. It feels really scammy. I would not mess with it right now. If I was pretty much anyone, I don't think I would touch NFTs with a fucking hundred foot pole unless you're just willing to burn money do not touch them right now uh, it looks like he functionally made uh, an nft trading card thing about all of these different people and uh, it looks like some people were kind of pissed and here's logo's response tldr i'm not making a fucking nft and i'll let my lawyer take it from here this is a dishonest twist on the reality of your actions you say you just want to share art but you laid out a roadmap for a second drop and an app on your website you have five levels of rarity and a 200 plus floor you can't claim you reached out i checked you sent you sent a twitter dm less than 24 hours ago and already completed the art you didn't even follow me on twitter until slime's quote retweet it feels like you just reached out to cover your ass rather than get permission uh claiming this is for my community is insane because my community roasts nft projects for their shady practices i agree with this um and this is a big problem with a lot of nfts uh your project being a prime example i assume the other creators are in the same boat as me so who could an nft enthusiast trust to make sure this isn't a rug pull you and the other founder created your twitters this month where's the accountability there is nothing more than a low this is nothing more than a low effort scam you're trying to make a few thousand from my viewers and my viewers of other large streamers the worst part is you're a talented artist but it's all going to waste i don't disagree with that and that's kind of what it comes across that's what most nfts come across does um i don't deny that there could be some plausible usage and the usage that i could see for nfts is on a very minor scale and it's so overrun by negative right now that it doesn't even matter i think this is a good example i think if you steal if you're trying to use the likeness of someone to become you know like make money off of it i feel like i don't know it's it's really hard to describe i just i think it's really wrong to do the asmr section is insane dude holy shit oh, hello Oh god, I cannot stand the fucking sound of ASM like that, the fucking mouth. <laughs> She's scratching her nipples. Oh god, I cannot stand it. I don't know how people listen. Oh god, it's uncomfortable. How do people listen to that? Like, you know how some people get like good tinglies? It feels like bugs are crawling all over my fucking skin whenever I hear that. I'm just like, oh god. It's like being in a nest of fucking cockroaches. Oh god, that is the exact feeling that I get, is in a nest of goddamn cockroaches. Everything about about that is uncomfortable and not like it. Okay, which one is the real XQC? This is like the million dollar question. I think based on, I don't watch XQC. I think it's this one. So I think this is the nicest looking camera. I like how basically his reaction is the same throughout all of these. It's, it's the same throughout all of them. I mean, that's good, right? It's probably good to find something that gives you that level of happiness. Well, let's start with I always start with Ouija, because I want to summon the devil of Wordle. With clonk. Why is that his favorite word? That's such a weird favorite word. Everyone knows clonk is scientifically the best word to start with. I actually don't think that's true. Because you have you have a bunch of... The world that I've come across on TikTok is fucking uh, algorithm like TikTok, where they actually have went through and like analyzed what is the best starting word to remove the most possibilities. And I don't remember what word it is. I want to say it's like Riot or something like that. Row 8 is supposed to be a really popular one because uh, it utilizes like... Well, it utilizes three vowels and two possibilities popular continents that are R and T. Point being, clunk is not a fucking good start and first word. Okay, like there's nothing about clunk that is like a good word. Cock? Yeah, that's right. I feel like you have to admit, if you get anything on your second guess with Wordle, it's probably luck, right? Like there has to be a level of luck, right? Just because of, like the amount of, you have two, va like you have two, uh, you have three, two letters you don't know, one letter you do know that is going to go in one of the two spots. 
I don't understand why people are so proud of their penises. I don't know either. Like, they're quite ugly. Like, they're just like, you know. That they want to, like, show it off everywhere. Oh, yeah, that's just weird. Unsolicited. You know, I, I, I'm going to say it. Dick pics in general are not an attractive thing, right? Like, I don't know. It's just not something I'm like, ooh, that's attractive. To be honest, I mean, we have to admit that, like, I, I, I don't think genitalia in general is very attractive, right? Like, everything else besides that is actually the part that is attractive. Oh, it's God. broken. <gasps> Oh god, I know exactly. Oh god, that's so sad. I have to go. I can't do it anymore. I'm pain. Pain. I don't blame her. I guess she has. Is this the fastest VTuber for getting over it? Someone said she has an eight minute run. I'm just gonna play on the slide. I'm just gonna play on the slide. Whee! I understand. I'm playing pogo stuck. I won't lie. I understand this. I understand this life. I understand what it's like to be mentally broken. I remember when uh, I was bashing my little pogo stuck man's head against thorns for like five minutes because it was just, it was going crazy. Give me mutant emblem and I will masturbate on street. Fuck. <laughs> well, we get to see how, tr how, how truly long Twitch will ban someone. <sighs> oh God. What in, what in the God's name is... Why? Why? Everything about this is uncomfortable in many ways. I do not like this. How is this a thing? My ears do not like that either. It's so uncomfortable. Mm. It's just a loop too. I'm uncomfortable. I don't like that. I just want to cry now. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, that wraps up our time with LSF. If you like this, if you're watching this on the YouTubes or something like that, please make sure to subscribe down below. And uh, don't forget to check out my stream Monday through Friday, 12 p.m. CST.